Welcome to the October Burns & Co walkthrough auction this Sunday, the 26th of October, starting at 10am. And just a reminder that our open day is this Friday from 12 o'clock to 5 o'clock. So no, no open inspection here on Saturday. Auction starting 10am Sunday. Once again, quick walkthrough for you, not in any lot order. It has been lotted up with just over 400 lots. Great range of furniture. Probably the uh, strongest selection of, uh, of good clean household furniture we've had for some time. All here, totally unreserved once again. So just bear with me, nice old meat safe there. Got a bit of character. Sideboard there for you. Even an old organ. Look at that. There we go, that could tell a story, couldn't it? So just bear with me as I'll give you a quick walk through. As I already mentioned, no, no specific uh, order here. This is just sort of uh, as I found it. Starting at um, starting at 10 a.m. this Sunday. Okay, so please um, keep that in mind. And also, the open day is Friday. So once again, please make sure you've got that in the forefront of your mind. Open from 12 to 5 on Friday. Lots of white goods here in this particular sale. Good range of fridges and freezers. A lot of them are only fairly new. Several lots come out of the Vines Retirement Village, so a lot of the furniture is only fairly new. Bookshelf there for you, they're always popular. 1970s, 1980s timber furniture. Another fairly, there's a flat screen t TV there. Dining table and chairs. There's another LJ, LG fridge. Good range of beds, anyone looking for some beds for uh, Pickers quarters or shearing shed, couldn't go wrong with this sale. Lots of beds. There's a set of old wool scales there. Another Asta fridge. Here's a stainless steel hospital cabinet here. It's a bit unusual. There we go. Can't say I've had one of those in here before. Sofa bed. Excellent range of clean household furniture here. So there we go, round the corner. Typical range of smalls. Don't seem to have any trouble getting those. Double bed. Books and games and DVDs and videos. More kitchenware, vases. Here's some good clean furniture out of one of the units in the vines. Glass top table and chairs. Good washing machine here, Fisher and Parker. It hasn't done a lot of work. So there we go, that one there. More shelf lots for you. More beds. Here's some nice vintage furniture out of a house lot over there in Wentworth. Nice table and six leather chairs. Another dining table. A couple of nice leather chairs. No beauties. I like those. Yeah, marble top. Dressing table. Lovely book bookshelf, glass top bookshelf. Have a look at that. That's in good order too. That's a nice piece. Then we've got the um, dressing table. Duchess there. Hall stand. Nice enough. Here we go. Lamps. Rocking chairs. Gives you a bit of an idea. Pair of single beds. Got a good range of beds in here before, as I mentioned before. Nice metal chest kitchen dresser there, wardrobe, lounge suites, several lounge suites there, good selection of uh, dining table and chairs for anyone that's looking at setting up a home there, couldn't go wrong, there's more, nice retro fridge covered in uh, stickers of the day, there we go, even got an Adelaide Crows one there for me. Tent, more furniture, office furniture, kitchen buffet, more tables and chairs, electric cement mixer, always handy enough around the place. Another rocking chair, washing machine, clothes dryer, another lot of colonial tables and chairs, early singer sewing machine, big kitchen or lounge room uh, entertainment unit there for you. 
kitchen prints, more shelf lots of books. Good selection of books there for you. Okay, bit of uh, a bit of electrical there. There's a um, grinder coming through here. Another hall stand there for you. Leather lounge suite. Laundry cupboard, lamps, more beds, another lounge suite, more tables and chairs, more beds, more beds, more white goods, fridge freezer side by side there to be sold separate. Okay, pretty clean. Then we've got more white goods. Yep. Old radiogram, that's the shell only, unfortunately. Another clothes dryer there. Then we finish off down inside here with some more shelf lots. Always seem to fill the back shelves up. More beds. More beds there for you. Bit of vintage stuff here, some marble, brassware. Good selection of old stone jars, the brassware and mirrors there, a couple of old petrol boxes. Don't see a lot of them around anymore. Another shelf lot of tools and bits and pieces from the shed. Rubber boots there, 1970s generator. She's a classic. XW, XY uh, grills there. Big toolbox for somebody there for you. Doors, some army boxes there. Complete toilet, including the system. Radiator for a car, toolboxes, super spreader jacks. This is a uh, muffler come pipe bender. Three phase. There's the, the bits that go with it in those army boxes. This is an interesting piece. This is a grader blade to suit a uh, grey Fergie tractor. Can't say there'd be too many of them around. And then we've also got the lathe there, the metal lathe as well. Washing machine. Nice uh, retro kitchen table and six chairs in pretty good order too. Another big uh, kitchen entertainment unit there. Or lounge entertainment unit, probably more so. Okay. Got some... Let's turn the phone off. More furniture. Some smalls, so there we go, normal cabinet falls, cabinets of smalls, more collectibles and kitchenware there for you, the John Deere tractor, ideal for the grandkids, some prams, that's sort of about it inside, then outside just let the light adjust, we've got a good selection of poly pipe there for you, good selection of poly pipe. Pick of the items for the auction is no doubt the Triumph motorbike. There it is there, 2012 model American is the is the model. Done 19 kilometres. Got the receipt here for it. Paid 16,000 and done 19 kilometres. So there you go, comes with the cover, it's got the bags, got all the keys with it, got obviously got the manuals, got everything, got the delivery receipts, the whole lot. You won't find one cleaner. Guy bought it and has never risen. Never ridden it. 19 kilometres on the clock. You show me where you can find one better than that. So there we go. Black buckets, some tyres, wheelbarrows, portable shower for the fruit block or the camping, some outdoor furniture, barbecue. Then we've got a boat. Seem to dig them out every sail. There's a boat there for you. Trailer, handy enough to go to the dump. Some more furniture, a bit of garden stuff. Some more wooden outdoor furniture. A couple of blowers. And then to finish off, and as I mentioned, this is in no particular order. This is just how it is. And there's the sale date, 26th of October, starting at 10am this Sunday. Registrations 12 to 5 on the Friday. Okay, please don't forget that. 12 to 5 for registrations and viewing on Friday. And we've even got a poly tank there for you. So there we go. That's the walkthrough for the Burns & Co. October auction. Keep in mind our next auction is uh, the 30th of November. We've also got three other 
uh, vendor only, uh, single vendor only sales in November. Two out at Pomona and one out at, um, at uh, Mildura South. There'll be further details on our website at www.burnsandco.com.au or follow the Mildura Weekly newspaper or you can call us anytime on 50235 000. So there you go. There's the Burns and K walkthrough. See you Sunday.